Here we are, Dory. Ready for your exciting weekend walkies? Huh. This is only the 274th time here doing the same loop at the same speed. wonder when she got so difficult to please. Maybe she's right. Maybe there is a way to spice up our weekend walks. Is this you? Then this video is here to help you. It's easy to be outside and still be blind to all the nature around you. But if you fully engage with it, then you'll have a much better time on your walks. Here is a guide to the best times of year to see different types of wildlife, and it can give you a better idea of what to look for when you're out. It's a good idea to buy a beginner's plant ID guide as soon as possible and become familiar with the most common plants. Summer trees are a good place to start since leaf shapes are often easily distinguishable between species. Admiring pretty plants becomes much more interesting when you can identify them. Plant size, leaf shape, flower colour and petal arrangement all help with identification and there are many YouTube videos dedicated to learning basic botany and recognising plant families to supplement your new plant ID guides. This yarrow from the daisy family is just one of the many plants you'll be able to identify after just a little practice. In the winter, without the leaves on the trees, it is often easier to spot birds. But make sure to walk slowly and quietly to increase your chance of seeing and hearing more. Binoculars and a beginner's bird guide are a worthwhile investment for bird watching, as well as bird song CDs. Don't you want to be able to identify birds like this beautiful blue tit and enjoy their beauty through your new binoculars? The summer is arguably the easiest time of year to enjoy wildlife, not only because of the warm weather, but because a lot of animals are far more active and more plants are flowering. Look out for basking reptiles in tusky grassland, woodland edges and log piles. Being cold-blooded, they like to warm up in the sun, but want nearby shelter to quickly retract into if needed. Warm, dry summer evening walks are perfect times to see bats flying overhead or foraging and can provide interesting variation to your daytime walks. I hope you now have some inspiration to spice up your Sunday walk. If you're having more fun, the ones you're with will too.